What's up, fellow builders? Today, we will unbox and review the newest released unbranded 1 is to 144 high grade Astaroth. Let's go! For the mobile suit's articulation, let's start with the head. The head can look up and down, and right and left. It can also rotate to a full 360 degrees. The shoulder armors can be raised up to this high, same as the arms. The arms can rotate to a full 360 degrees. and can give a decent elbow bend. The close fist hands are ball jointed, so it can give us a better movement. There's a little up crunch on the lower part of the body, and it can rotate to a full 360. For the waist, front skirt can be raised up to this high, so was the side flaps. There's no articulation on the back skirt area. The legs can be raised forward up to this high. Raising the legs backward will be limited. Legs can rotate up to 190 degrees and will give us a decent knee bend. The feet is ball jointed, so expect to get a lot of articulation movements on that area. 
Here are the additional parts and weapons of Pasteron. This kit has lots of issues. It spoils stickers, parts keeps on falling off, loose joints, bad plastic molding, and cheap plastic quality. Yeah, I enjoyed building this kit, but I'm not happy with the quality of the material. For me, this kit feels like the old school crappy Titi Hongli high grade kits. I'm still happy I have this kit for my IBO collection, but I think I can't really recommend this kit. For me, this kit will get the score off. Once again, my name is Gundam Deck, and thank you for watching.